Woof. You're okay, Mario. Hey guys, Jerd here, and today I'm reacting to a video called Evil Stick Toy Full Report. Now, apparently this is about an evil kid's wand or something for little girls that shows something. I don't even know. Let's just watch. A disturbing image hidden inside a toy purchased at a local dollar store. New Center 7's Lauren Clark with why a Kettering mother wants it off the shelves. A mother bought her toddler this princess wand at the dollar store behind me. Imagine her surprise when the curious little girl peeled back the foil to find this image of a girl cutting herself inside. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my goodness. So there's a picture of a little girl slitting her wrist in a wand. Oh, what is this? The packaging promises fairies and quote wonderful music, but I doubt many people would call this music. <laughs> it's difficult to see the image clearly in the dark, but if you pull back the foil, there's no mistaking it. If you look close enough, it's not a drawing. It's an actual picture of the girl slitting her wrist. <laughs> What is this? I'm outraged over it. I want to know how, how they think that that is suitable for a child. Nicole Allen said she found the wand for her two-year-old daughter in the toy section of the $1 store on Linden Avenue last weekend. There was Barbie dolls on one side and baby dolls on the other side. Then why didn't you get them a Barbie or a baby doll? Instead, you go for like a weird Japanese style wand with a stupid anime character on the front. You're the woman who cheaped out, even at a $1 store where isn't any, isn't everything at a $1 store meant to be a dollar? The owner of the store told me parents need to pay more attention to what they're buying for their children. The name on it, it says Evil Stick. So from the name, I would, ha if I'm buying it for my kid, and I have a lot of kids, and I have young ones, I would inspect it before I even give it to them. Parents need to pay more. Yeah, that would make sense if you were buying a toy like in the shape of something phallic or something weird. But this is literally a picture of a girl slitting her wrist hidden inside of a toy. I don't think that it falls to the parent's responsibility there. He also said that while he would not buy the toy for a toddler, he thinks it's okay for older kids. For a five, six, seven, ten years old, I mean, they see that on TV every day. You see on TV every day kids slitting their wrist. It's like every single day, isn't it? Five and six-year-olds, they're fine with it. They do it every day. Yeah. Perfectly fine. What the heck is that guy thinking? This is my dog Tux. 